Dread Templar is what we lovingly refer to as a boomer shooter, aka a retro slash classic FPS first person shooter. Uh, it is $14.99. It is early access and it is uh, a pretty solid standalone single player like campaign driven uh, experience. Uh, they definitely play a lot with your with your nostalgia uh, nostalgic feelings by throwing in all of these uh, design elements and stuff that harken back to the eras of Doom, Quake, Hexen, stuff like that. Loved Hexen, just bad, never really ran on my PC though. <laughs> I ran like shit. Um, but yeah, they really do a good job of, of of making the game feel, making you feel right at home if you grew up playing some of those games. Now, uh, uh, there's not a whole lot to speak of in terms of like options and all that stuff, so I can just show you that right now. Uh, controls, you can rebuy on control, that's great, of course. Game settings, I turned this off, so just FYI, if you look at other gameplay footage and you see like the, the screen tilting all over the place, you could turn that off. All this is, is basically your, your camera drifts uh, left and right, kind of tilts left and right when you're running around. It's very nauseating, for me anyways. Maybe you're fine with it. Uh, ammo bar, let's turn that on actually uh tips we can just leave that on i guess honestly uh, audio everything else is good fov see and there's nothing else you can really mess with bloom v-sync yeah so what so you can't there's no alias msa nothing like that uh it's just basic settings now what i'm gonna show you today is i'm uh let's see actually i am what am i i'm uh i'm three i'm actually working on level four right now they don't unlock until you're done uh, and so that's only only in the first chapter here and I was playing on normal the levels are actually pretty long So what I want to do today is I have a couple of saves already markered that kind of show off some fun stuff um, And so what I'll do is I'm gonna I'm gonna start I want to try a single-player run uh, On hell which is the hardest difficulty so, I've not done this yet. <laughs> uh, let's see. The corner in front of you leaves the trailer where you'll learn the basic controls of the important game mechanics. Nah, 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 nah. We're just going to go through here and just going to skip the whole thing. There we go. We're going to lead you to the campaign. Good luck. Yep, no problem. All right. So, <laughs> it's a little shortcut to get past the tutorial if you'd like. Uh, all right. There's a little bit of story here. I'll let you guys read that on your own. It's, it's deep. It's super deep. Um, one thing. What the very first thing I noticed, right? First off, it's called E1M1, and when I got in, I was like, oh, hold on a second. There's got to be, like, a secret or something like that where I could go get a chainsaw or something, right? Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these katanas, I'm going to put them together to make a javelin, throw it over here, boop. Hey, look at that. So these design elements that you would expect to be here are here. <laughs> you know, when you see, like, a corner and you're just like, well, hold on a second, there might be a chest around the corner, and you go and there is, you're just like, yeah, yeah. Now, uh, that katana is back in my my uh, possession here. Um, it will, you can use it as a melee if you like, or you could do that and and then uh, throw it like a javelin, or like a spear, rather. I know there's some baddies over here. And then it takes a minute, but it'll come back to you. There's also another feature. Well, oh, they take a whole lot of bullets. <laughs> They got that quake style super slow shooting, which you would think, oh man, it's too easy to dodge all that stuff. Oh dang, I didn't want to do that. Uh, but in reality, when there's like a whole bunch of those dudes shooting at you, you just uh, 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 lose track of bullets. Uh, so I want to smash all these things up because I lost a little bit of health there. And like I said, this is hell. So I kind of want to, <laughs> hell difficulty. So I kind of want to stay on top of things. A little secret right here. Oh, look at that, a little bit of health, perfect. Is this a thing? Nope. Okay. Are there any of these? Nope. Okay. All these crates break up. Sometimes you... F I don't know if you know if you find health in any of these things. But but you can break them. So you have to. Because you can. Hold on. Dude's here. Oh, dang it. I was not expecting him to break right like that. But it seems to get hung up on geometry, though. Might have to exploit that a little bit. Scrap these bullets. Ah, oh, shit. So, lastly, the last thing to show you is that you have the ability to slow down time briefly. The bar at the top of the screen there turns blue, fills blue as you kill the bad guys. Oh, did I miss them? Oh, I can't believe I missed them. God, they're sneaky, man. They'll come around those corners and they'll blast you. No problem. Anyways, so oh, oh, you can slow down time ever so briefly. Oh, like that. That was that was 
ever, ever so briefly. Oh my gosh. Uh, wait for the come back here. Switching. Okay, we'll break it apart. Get out of the I need health now. I need health. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be so hard. Actually, this is a whole lot easier than I thought it would be. Uh, when you play Nightmare on uh, in Doom or any of the other games, um, you know the game. The game basically just just tells you no, and then and then it makes you start over uh, at the, uh, the the previous or the, the lower uh, setting. It doesn't. It doesn't. It's not always so forgiving. There's a guy over here. Can I shoot through here. We can shoot through there. So I can shoot through there. Sure can. All right. Cool. Couple boxes there. I'll let them live. I'll let them live. Come on, where's my thing? Thank you. I was like, where is it? I like walk around with my fists out. You can't punch, by the way. You can't punch. Uh, there's no. Whoa. Gosh, there's a pause before you throw. I got used to that. Uh, there's no. Whoa. Uh, multiplayer. There's no time trials or anything like that. It's a very basic game. Dang it. Dog, oh, damn. Whoa. It's a very basic single player campaign driven title. Shotgun, by the way. Okay, I know there's something up here, though. Yeah. We can also dash. Did I mention that part? Okay, look at that save. Oh, okay, it's making a new save. This is actually hard. <laughs> Oops. Dang it. Didn't want to do that. I want to come down here and see if there's something I missed. There is. Looks like a secret, though. Where's the bad guy at? There's always one. Just, just what, some shotgun shells, is it? Oh, you know, I guess in this mode. <laughs> I guess in this mode, every, every last shot counts. I'm just desperately looking for health. Music's pretty good. Music's pretty good. Other on, I can't, no, no complaints about the music. Probably wouldn't give it too many listens to offline. It's not like Proteus. Or Doom or anything like that. Oh, there's a lot of guys here. Okay. These guys are gonna stalk me, aren't they? Yep. Gotta be careful. There's more. And let's get a shot. There he is on top of the thing. Okay, shot it out. Shot it out. Mod 13 health. Let's do it. This blue energy here will refill your time ability. But just should use more. I'll be honest with you. Like I did not use it. Whoa. Whoop. Uh, at, like basically at all. Uh, playing through normal. You don't need it. Uh, even here, there's only only times I can see it being handy is when those fucking dudes right there sneak up on you and they're hiding right around a corner. That's when. That's when. Oh, did I get two and one? Oh, baby, that's sexy. Like that. This is when it's handy. I would have just died right there. Oh, shit. Hold on. Keep some distance here. Yeah, now you guys come over here. Oh, I totally missed. Can't let them get too close because they will open fire immediately. There we go. Ooh, man. Clenching over here. Seven health. Making it last. Whoa. Okay, we can probably nail this guy, right? Okay, there's more over there, though. This is where I came from, right? Let me see. No. No, definitely not! I get some headshots with this thing. It does register headshot damage, but center of mass is just so much easier to hit. <laughs> I'm sniping these dudes. But for reals, you can make it through this thing. I mean, just as I am now. I've only used it a handful of times. But it has come in handy in some clutch uh, moments. But normal mode? Yeah, you don't need it. Maybe later on, there'll be some super tough enemy or something like that. And you're like, oh dang, I need to slow things down. Stop being a bee. Get out of here and just start shooting. Start shooting and dodging. Get good. This is where I die, right here. Right? This is which is locked by some sort of mechanism. Oh, that's right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, of course, of course. 
horse. Where's he at? There he is. Right through the freaking head. Awesome. How much ammo do I have? I have a lot of ammo. I guess I just start shooting up stuff. Instead of waiting for that damn thing to come back every time. This is a door? Not now. Oh, what? Okay. I saw that before. Later on, I, th I thought it was, uh... Maybe it's a time, a time related secret. Well, no, there's no timer anywhere. There's no leaderboards, anything like that. Okay, that was important over there. I mean, I just did this level, but I mean, I'm several, I'm like a couple hours into the game and, and uh, I've only gone through like four levels because they're so fucking long. Okay. Do I get a red key card? No, I did not. Oh, snap. Okay. Oh, so we're going back. Can I go down here? I sure can. Oh, I bet this is where I get it. Just kidding. <laughs> this is a pretty good run so far, though. For hell mode, shit, I'll be happy to unlock this first level here. Not to show you guys anything else, because this has already got plenty of action. No, there's, there's a couple more weapons that you get later on. Okay, so this thing's being locked by a red door. I already came through here, already went through here, went all the way down here. Is there some direction I missed? No, I still need a red key. There's no map either. Just just to, just to name more things that this game does not have. But you know what? It also does not have an additional ten dollars on top of the title price. It's fourteen dollars and ninety nine cents. And I looked at I, I looked at that beforehand because I kept thinking, man, this game's missing so many things. Uh, and the reality is, is like the game is just not that. It's not that game. You know, where it's twenty four ninety nine. It has a built in editor, all that stuff. Okay, this is where we came in. Okay, there's a other path that we did not take. We freaked out, right? And we came back. Let me see. The left is the one. Okay, the right. Did we clear this out and get anything from here? Or we just cleared out the, the bad dudes? We just cleared out the bad dudes. And there's more here. Yep. Okay. Every time. I guess every time they're just gonna move. Of course they are. They're trying not to die. They gonna come up? No, okay, but these guys are in a great position to get sniped, though. Uh oh, so am I. Yep. Got you, bitch. Yeah. Did I hit me? Did that actually hit me? Oh, snap! Whoa, man. Shaw, I'm sweating balls right now. Actually, no, I'm fine. I'm totally fine. I'm chill. Just, uh, just trying to record some videos late night and, you know, on Tuesday. Or Monday, rather. Just relaxing. I'm not at all freaking out about the mom might be right around the corner. Aha! Here we go. So, yes, the unlocks thing. I would have totally forgot about this. So, you can actually tailor your weapons. You get 10 weapons, ultimately, um, and you can tailor them to be, uh, to just work maybe a little bit more in your, whatever style you, you like to play, uh, uh, with. So, like, shotguns, there was, like, one that, like, narrowed the beam of a shotgun or something like that, the spread of a shotgun, and then there's another one that, uh, made it do a little bit more damage. In this case, we're just gonna get stuck with, uh, slightly increased pistol and SMG damage, so it's pretty boring stuff. You get the red things to, that will unlock the slot, and then you get the runes that you could take and, you know, swap them out, uh, or just reset, and then you move things around if you'd like to. Um... So yeah, there are ways to kind of tailor this stuff. Nothing that I really picked up so far, again, four levels in, has really been like, ooh, wow, this really changes the game, or nothing like that. <laughs> it's funny, I feel like, whoa, I feel like they added a whole bunch of stuff to make the game feel a little bit more modern. But the reality is it doesn't need that. But you know, because it's kind of nice to have, you know? Like, I guess this is pretty nice for moments like that, right? <laughs> and you know, maybe the, I guess the dodge is nice, but you know, most arena shooters have dodge anyways. Oh, God, oh, oh God. So you're kind of used to that, uh, or some kind of or some kind of method of like dancing around all over the place. I'm from 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 I know. Hell no! You guys got your you guys got your taste. <laughs> you guys got your taste. All right, let's now let's do this level select. Let's see where we're at. Let's go uh, uh, load game. Uh, I believe it's this one here. We'll load that up. Oh no, this is not it. This is not it. My bad. Let's see, we we'll go back back one, two, four, three. There we go. Four. Perfect. I think there's like a, this is like a room or something right here, and we get a, we have a couple more weapons that I could uh, demonstrate for you guys. Yes, this is perfect. 
Okay, so check this out. So you have layers on your weapons, right? So I have a shotgun, single, and then I have another shotgun, double. Uh, this is similar to, 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 to actually, uh, I think, Doom and Quake, uh, and maybe even Hexen, actually, and several other games. I mean, countless other games. Um, all right, so I think, I think, yeah, I know where this is going to go. So yeah, lots of baddies. What else we have? We have, uh, uh, we have dual Uzis. And then we see, and then we also have a trap launcher, and then we have the swords. Yep, okay, cool. Music. Uh, getting heavier, bone on music. Oh, I'm heavier, I'm so heavy. That's uh, heavy music. Oh, it's a long distance shotgun, sure. Normal mode, by the way. I'm telling you. There's just. I mean, I'm taking, I've am taken like three hits already. I should be dead. <laughs> There's no reason I should be alive right now. There he goes. Fire the trap off. Zzz, freeze my place. Line them up and then... Oh, God. Oh, I messed up. I had to detach them. Come on. Charge me, bro. Charge me, bro. Charge me, charge Uh, went through both of them, but I don't think... Yeah, it did. It did serious damage, though. Wow, I melted that dude. Afterwards. Oh, man. It's it. Well... We'll just do a little bit of exploring. I've already done this part, so we'll just kind of move around a little bit. The music's gotten chill. And we'll go ahead and, uh, let me see. Get this. And I got my 29 health. See these sons of bitches? They like to hide around those corners. God, yellow key opens up that door. Sweet. Maybe they'll give you a little cutscene here. Although, you know, I... <laughs> I remember a time. I... <laughs> uh, if you have ever seen my marathon uh, playthrough that I did, which is like a 1994 shooter, and I think I, I, I did the Let's Play like in 2015 or something like that. If you've ever seen it, you remember, um, or maybe if you've played the game or any other uh, older uh, game like that, shooter, uh, it had a, what's it, uh, whenever you triggered a, tr a, a switch or something, there we go. There's a, there's a platform down there, but I just like to jump it for some reason. Um, Whenever you switch to a, um, son of a bitch, or you hit a switch to unlock something somewhere else in the world, you can hear it, and you got, you, you're like, you cut turning like this, so you could, you could like, hear where it's coming from, you know? Um, <laughs> and I kind of wish this game had that, like, it's nice, it's cool that it has the, um, it has the cutscene that shows you where, but at the same time, it's like, no, nah, man, come on, you show me, you show me the answer. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, this thing is all opened up here. So there's probably some bad guys coming up. There's some stuff over there, but I've already done it. We'll grab some of this here. There we go. Keep on making our way up. We go to the next big room of guys. Blow some shit up. Then we'll get out of here. So yeah, I mean, it's for $14.99. Like, I mean, this is this is a good buy. You know, $14.99 for uh, for your 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 various episodes, E1, M1 through whatever. Um, various difficulties and we've seen that you know the hard mode is pretty hard the hell mode uh it is pretty difficult but where you actually have to use the the slow mo and the gimmicks and all that stuff oh lots of guys here it goes this, this is a good time to use this okay reload it's a good time to reload during slow motion oh i'm out of ammo there let me see this guy oh it's a big fat trap throwing blob oh oops, that was wrong are they gonna hit it can i can i can i fire it from here no i cannot okay Oh gosh, I forgot. Bam. Bam. And the gameplay feels great. I mean, I feel right at home on this thing. I play a ton of these damn shooters. Um, and each one, like, you know, you, once you get the mouse and everything tailored just right, like, it just has a feel, you know? This this has it. Like, it has that feeling. Is that a secret right there? No, okay. It's gonna blast his face. There you go. And there it is. Leave the level screen slowly melts away it shows like you know some like gore or something in the background plays some cool music dun, 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 dun. but nothing I guess <laughs> it's early access there's still time there's still a time for them to put it in there uh, so here we go um, I do have one big complaint actually I have one big complaint with the game um, let me see if I can make it to a uh, to a to a save real quick oh look at this Look at this. We got ourselves a bow and arrow. 
Y'all know I love these in like every game. Oh, I am already. Shit. Messed up. Okay. Let's just shoot that wall underneath him like 15 times in a row. God dang. Should have stopped the video five minutes ago. Let me see. Now looking for a save. We're gonna hit this thing. Okay. Uh, maybe it's in there. We're just gonna speed around this thing. No problem. Oops. <laughs> All right. So, anyways, my my complaint that I have is whenever you go to save the game, like I like to go in and just go like boom, 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 done. Right? Like just smash the key, hit F5, whatever. Right? When you go to save a game at a checkpoint, it's like hit E to save, then click where you want the save to go, then click on confirm, and then or save, and then you have to click escape. Like it's so many buttons just to save the game. That's like the only complaint I have about the fucking game. <laughs> That's like pretty much it. So Dread Templar currently available uh, on on Steam, fourteen dollars ninety cents early access uh, from One C Entertainment, uh, which I believe One C is the ones they brought us. Um, Viscera, Vis Viscera, Viscera, oh god, what is it? Vis Viscera Fest, I think? Uh, which I, I think that's the same game that Darnell did, uh, uh, some videos on, like, a while back. Basically just, like, body parts and shit all over the place, and you have to clean it up, because you're the, uh, you're the janitor. Uh, <laughs> but that's it. Uh, my name is Mike B, aka Phony, Dread Templar. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.